folks, EC7 here, welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to Farm Sim 22. So big patch this morning, patch 1.10. Um, nothing of interest. <laughs> Basically, it's adding esports to Farm Sim. So yeah. The good content they can hide behind Seasons Pass paywalls. And in all honesty, the crap that no one wants, and in this game I use the term most loosely, um, they hand you for free. So, And from what I understand, uh, I don't know what particular mods, maps, etc. are responsible, but uh, I guess it's broken, uh, well more than a few people's games it's only doing partial loads and you're forced to basically demod and start from scratch and then i guess uh, as the modders catch up they'll be able to patch everything back in now luckily enough i got to jump in and uh, not find myself with those issues i'm not gonna make it that way can i Let's try and get the trailer under this boat. There we go. Look at that. It's going to cost us a bit of money. But we need to start prepping our new f our fields for next year. Well, I guess this year, actually. Okie dokie. Now, so I know that this needs pH because, as you can see, the value is uh, poor. So, my only question is. And I'm pretty sure I do. I think we want to join these two fields. Um, hmm. So, what's my best way? Do I just simply take this road out? I think so. Alright, let's... Uh, let's park up the... Uh, Spreader of the lime for the moment and grab ourselves a plow. There we go. That should be well out of the way. So I hope everybody's doing well. It is... Uh, it won't tell me. I believe it's the 6th of June today. So yeah, getting on there. And apparently... The new owners of our building, who actually live in Surrey, Vancouver, not here in town, are going to be here today. Not at my apartment. But in fact, at the, uh, oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, man. Yeah, this is just... Oh, we made it. Ha, <laughs> ha. Yeah, they're going to, uh the apartment of the people that they've already handed notices to. So. We'll see how that goes. Alright, what I basically want to do to start with is kind of blend this bit in with that bit. And I think rather than removing the entire road Oh, I should unfold this so we can figure out where we really are. 
I'm gonna just give it a bit of a, a swooping angle and we'll go from there so and I think that'll actually work pretty well so let's get right to the edge all right right about there we're gonna wanna allow create drop it down it should insta create and it does all right so right from that edge I want to basically just go straight across to this edge. Perfect. All right, now. So yeah, unfortunately, um, Although I offered to uh, let my neighbor there that's got the eviction notice come over and look at the government website about how they can maybe, uh, you know, save their apartment. I guess it didn't, uh, they don't really have much interest. Sorry to say they're a little bit on the, uh, <coughs> excuse me, druggy side. So, yeah, I guess that kind of takes priority over here worries of housing and such but we'll see we'll see i don't plan to uh, go down as easy i mean if they've got all the legal stuff in place then you know i'm not going to be a dick just for the sake of being a dick even though it means uh well <sighs> pretty much a catastrophe in my life but oh well There we go. And that... Should be that. Let's see if we can get back into the farm without hanging this thing on the gate. Side is looks like a black car up close and then you get back about 10 feet and you realize it has a light golden yellow sheen to every inch of it and it's the amount of pollen out of the local fir trees they're just nuts it's been a year for it <clears throat> and I don't generally have allergies but when there's just simply that much of it in the air you know like literally you can see it in sunbeams and stuff just this cloud of constant yellow haze and it's just pollen like that tree literally puts out hundreds of pounds of it a year okay let's get out of the woods all right
so let's have a look here. Uh, no. There we go. All right, let's auto width. 18 meters. Okie dokie. Some of these things are just about impossible to back up. There's such a sharp angle between the trailer and the tractor. Okay. And we will simply continue all the way down. I would assume the second field, since it was pretty much treated identically to this one, is also going to be lacking, so we're just going to zip right on through here. There we go. <laughs> it was a little unsure. Hmm. Expensive little project this will be, but oh, that's okay. We have uh, fabric we can sell, we have eggs we can sell, we have a little bit of honey, um, and we have stacks and stacks and stacks of oil. So, yes indeed, we are regular oil barons. Hmm? Oh. That's, uh, that's fuel oil, apparently. But, uh, yeah, we got lots. And I think it's worth pretty good money. So if we end up having to drop 20 or 30k on our uh, fields here, well, so be it. It is needed. Alright. Oh, well. Oh, well. I'm not going to concern myself over little tiny itty bitty dots of uh, missing lime. How are we doing? 61%, eh? Hmm. We're definitely going to have to go for a refill. We only get two lines at 40%. Uh, yeah. We'll get about half the field done. Exactly, a, a light application here, but I guess we were a little bit off, so... Oh, 
I'm not used to that shut off being so instantaneous. Most of them don't work that way. Oh, good thing, I guess. We will, of course, have to uh, go down and visit the rest of our properties. I'm hoping the uh, grass fields don't require a pH adjustment, but there is a good chance that it will. That's going to cost some bucks. Yeah, it's absolutely instant. That little dot there, yeah, I purposely shut it off to see if it would leave that piece, and it did. So it is absolutely instant. That's nice, because it doesn't look that way. You look like you're wasting a bunch of it, and in fact, you're not. <clears throat> see what happens when we hit the bottom but I get a feeling this is about all we're gonna manage a little bit on the way back up and then we'll have to fill her and we'll get to see how much it costs to fill it right from empty this time that'll give us an idea of where we stand because we still got all of that including the big oat field Driving all the way to the other oat field. Oops, almost didn't clear the tree. Okay. You don't have access to this land. What? Oh, is that strip in the middle actually separate property? Really? Hmm. Uh huh. Okay, we're about to run out here. Seven, six, five. Ooh, we're getting close. Four. Are we going to actually make it? Three. No. <laughs> it's going to be close. Two. One. And... That's it. <laughs> All right, let's fill her up and head back out. I'm just going to leave the thing on there. We don't have much more to go. We can get right down to it. So. Yes, a lime. All right, here we go. How much is that trailer full of crushed dolomite? Ooh, it is at least five grand, eh? Yep. Mm, coming up on six. Uh, five, six, twenty-four. So fifty-six hundred dollars a trailer full. Well, that's not bad. So. Less than 10k to do this field. Go. 
Well, it's a bit of a harder one to get to from this end. Hopefully we don't have any weird glitches with the uh, plowed part because I notice every time we've crossed that center line it has skipped somewhere, you know, so I don't know. little bit we can get uh, I think without the aid of GPS mm, so far so good across there nice all right so let's turn the EPS off <coughs> head down here is obviously off on this one as well. So, what's our best, best bet for this guy? Now we'll see if we can be fancy and make this corner. <laughs> Make 
sure I get that missing bit, hopefully. Uh, not quite, eh? Well... Whoa. No, no, no. Oh, I hate these freaking hedges. Ugh. No, it just will not. So now I end up with this big section that's got nothing on it. It's because of the way it senses where it needs to, you know. So what I mean? Nothing. So now I've got an entire section in the field. That I can't do anything with. Look at that. It will not spray any on there. Nope. Nope, nothing at all. That really upsets me. I think I'm going to end up uninstalling the precision farming and screw it until Giants actually makes it work. Because I'm pretty sure it's what's causing this, right? Isn't that why the thing can turn on and off by itself? Like spray and stop spraying when there's nothing to spray on? Well, whatever it is that causes that does not recognize small areas. And you end up losing ground. Not impressed. Again, maybe instead of screwing around with esports that I don't think anybody really gives a dang about that plays farm sim. Um, you know, this isn't Dota or something. They could uh, work on things to actually make the portions of the game that are already here work properly. But, not to be, I guess. But yeah, I think uh, I'm just going to turn that off. I don't think it saves us enough of anything to justify what it uh, costs us.
Okay, we're out to the oat field. Do, 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 do. Catching up on some videos of cities there yesterday. And, uh, lucky guy. Got to ride in a tuk tuk. I've always wanted to. In fact, I've always thought they were one of the coolest vehicles ever. But, uh, yeah. Not to be. Alright, let's. Uh, oops. Didn't mean to jump out. Let's see what we can do here, shall we? Uh. Uh, what are we doing? Auto width is still okay. Yeah, see, it's all screwed up again. Why is there a line going all the way back to there? Hmm? to do? No. Offer. No. <laughs> no. I'm sorry, but no. Um, I'm going to end the episode there. Maybe if I save and start again next time, it'll actually allow me to uh, do it. And if anybody knows why it wants to do that or how I can fix it, please let me know. Because, uh, it's a really helpful mod, but if it doesn't bloody work, well, guess what? It's just not helpful anymore. <laughs> so, anyway, so is this now straightened out? It is. It's still got weeds growing, huh? Hmm. Well, it's all right. Anyway, guys, we are going to call it there, as I said. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, please remember to hit that like button. And until next time, take care of each other. And ciao. For now.